Hey everybody, welcome to my Judy movie review. If I had to describe this movie in one word, it would be the word sad. Uh, this movie is about the final days of Judy Garland. It isn't exactly a biopic. Um, with a lot of these movies, th this movie did something different that I like. A lot of these movies um, kind of tend to tell the the repeated story of, oh, the you know, the little person is... Uh, this nobody from nowhere is trying to make it big, they get discovered, they make it big, they do a bunch of drugs, and they get over the drugs and live happily ever after. Um, in this case, with this movie, uh, so it's based on Judy Garland's final days, so there's no spoilers here, um, unless you really didn't know that she died of a drug overdose. And I don't really know that it was a drug overdose. It, it goes back to when she was a little kid uh, working for the Meyer Brothers. And, you know, I, I feel like, you know, Mr. Meyer from Metro Golden Mayor, the second M in, in MGM, he was just like a Harvey Weinstein, Weinstein back then, except he never got exposed. Um, this girl was treated like as a child, as a minor, um, was worked to death. She was starved. They didn't let her eat. They kept her up. She didn't get to sleep. They put her on pills at an early age. She developed a dependency on pills. She developed chronic insomnia. She couldn't sleep. She didn't eat. She drank too much. And by the age of 47, it caught up to her. And really, in this movie, when you meet her, she's already a mess. She's got no place to stay. She has to call her ex-husband. Um, she's losing custody of her kids. It's a constant battle. She's broke. Um, she's still got that Hollywood name, so people like her, and, and you know, she, they'll do her favors and whatnot. But um, it's really a sad thing to see. Um, such a talented person. Um, it takes place around the time when she's doing her London shows, which she took to get money because she was not doing well financially. And really, a few months later, she died at the age of forty-seven. Probably, likely a combination of all the. Uh, pills, alcohol, lack of sleep, malnutrition, you name it. Um, she was a very much so a tortured soul, and that's sad to see. Um, I don't know that this would happen today, but we, you know, we got labor laws now. It seemed like back then you signed that contract and the government owned you. I, I know a, a lot of politicians today try to say we have this hyper-capitalism today. It's just not true. Those days are over. Um, they've been over, and what we have now is people trying to legislate a utopian society that will just never happen, and instead they're blaming political opposition uh, as to the reason why we do not live in said utopian society, which will never happen, um, because life does not take place inside of a classroom. Anyways, I'm getting sidetracked, um, but... Um, yeah, man, Hollywood messed her up. And, um, you know, when I say today, I mean child actors today. Because even in the 80s, a lot of those kid actors grew up... Even in the 90s, many of those kid actors got all messed up. Britney Spears was all messed up for a while. Then she got her act back together. Um, that that does something to a kid. Um, I, I'm a huge fan of, Gone, or of Not Gone With the Wind of Wizard of Oz. Um, it's, it's, what is it now, uh, 80 years old? Um, I think it's a timeless masterpiece. Uh, I, I do want to start putting together a master class collection set. I got a couple of other videos that I want to put together, um, first. But, uh, anyway, I give this movie an 80 on the Star Strider scale, and I, uh, I think Renee Zellweger might win the Oscar for Best Actress. I don't know that I've seen a better performance out of an actress. I think she really sang these songs, which is impressive. Um, Judy Garland um, singing her songs is no easy feat. Uh, if you're into Judy Garland, if you're into biopics of, of you know artists, actors, musicians, you're going to like this movie, um, and I recommend it for you. If not, uh, save your money. Uh, anyways... Uh, Leave your comments below. Let me know what you thought. Like and subscribe, and I will see you later. Okay, bye.